Hello, good morning. Welcome to our channel Yushi Talks and today we are going to talk about 90 Day Fiance and uh, uh, we are going to talk about two couples Yara and Joey and Julia and Brandon. Please watch the complete video and also subscribe to my channel. Let's get started. Yara is setting the record straight when it comes to her fiancé Jovi and his family's thoughts on Ukrainian women. In an exclusive clip from Sunday's 90 Day Fiancé, Yara says that it was never her goal to come to America and leaves Jovi and his mom Gwen speechless when she corrects them on their misconceptions about women in her country. In the clip, Yara, who recently found out that she is pregnant, is not amused when Jovi tells his parents that it was her dream to come to America before she even met him and says that uh, it wasn't. When she she asks him why he thought about her that he replies that because everybody from Ukraine wants to come to America. Gwen piles on telling her husband that a lot of Ukrainian women try to get a man just to get them to America. Yara tells them I don't like uh, that so much hearing because it's about my country. It's kind of some same stereotypes like many people think that Americans are so stupid. At this point the room just goes dead silent and Jovi's father you know, awkwardly clears his throat. Yara tells cameras, Jovi's parents tell me a little bit about Ukrainian girls, that in Ukrainian girls is so much tricking, want to get to America, it's not true. Yara, who has disliking living in New Orleans with Jovi so far, then shocks his parents when she tells him that she in fact isn't even sure if she wants to live permanently in America after she and Jovi get married. She suggests that she may want them to live in Budapest given that it's close to where her mother li lives. Gwen says uh, this concerns her and Jovi's parents also appear to not know that Yara is now pregnant. Jovi's dad tells cameras she wants to go to another country and move Jovi to another country. So that's a problem for us. Also in future if they have kids, I mean this could be hard for us to see our grandkids. We may lose our son. Gwen also knows I'm afraid that once they get married uh, that she's got that hold and she will take him away from us. Yara insists that she is not a gold digger and made no apologies for being blunt on the show, noting that she wasn't fake or liar. As for Joey, he is stressed out that he was not uh, an alcoholic after the reality series showed the couple fighting over how much he drinks. Of course, when Yara arrived in America, I was drinking a lot. He acknowledged I was under a lot of stress. We both were. I have been portrayed as an alcoholic but in reality I'm not. There are a lot of days that I don't drink. There are times that I go to work for months at a time and I don't drink. That's the only thing that bothers me being portrayed as something that I'm not. So that's all we have about uh, Yara and Joey. Let's talk a little bit about Julia as Brandon. Season 8 of 90 Day Fiance may be on Hiaras this week, but uh, Julia is providing fans with new information on Instagram. The fiance of Brandon Gibbs shared some information about her view and plastic surgery, while rumors continue to swirl around couples' relationship status. Brandon and Julia faced a bumpy time together in the United States due to Brandon's overbearing parents, Barry and Ron. The couple has made Russia, Russian Julia's time in uh, Virginia stressful by forcing her to abide by strict rules and perform tough farm work. Julia presented Brandon with an ultimatum, move out of his parents' house or with her or she's going back to Russia. Brandon half-heartedly stood up to his parents, which has led to speculation that the couple got their own apartment together. However, recent online rumors have suggested that the couple actually split and Julia is back in Russia. While they aren't able to confirm their relationship status, Julia was able to answer some questions about it. So Julia continues to impress TLC fans thanks to her English growing skills. Uh, while many 90 day fiancé cast members have undergone plastic surgery, Julia said no never when it comes to plastic surgery or implants. The Russian beauty has previously shared her fear of needles and firmly stated that her looks are all natural. She also said that she no longer dyes her hair though she did it in the past a long time ago. Unlike co-star Yara Zaya, Julia is not a fan of cosmetics. She says that honestly I don't paint only when it's necessary. She told a fan who inquired about her makeup and skincare preferences. I don't know how to paint. I don't use makeup. Julia also shared a br brief clip of herself stating that all the questions about her and Brandon are exhausting and she cannot reveal her re living situation or relationship status until the season finished airing. So that's all we have in today's uh, news. Please continue to watch this space and also subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching me. You have a wonderful day.